Hey guys, so I am finally doing the video on how to connect the Pixel 6 phone to an HDMI monitor using a cable. So I've done a, a two other videos in relation to this, but they were with a um, Pixel 3a XL or whatever it was, uh, old Pixel model. Uh, this is a Pixel 6, it's not the Pixel 6 Pro, but it applies to all of the Pixel phones. Um, I'll just flip this over so you can see this is a Pixel Pixel 6 phone. Um, so I have it connected to this portable external monitor, which is HDMI. Um, and it works. As you can see, you know, it's, it's responsive. Everything, um, you know, there's no lagginess or delay or anything. Um, it's just a... Uh, real nice and smooth image quality is is real good so you know it's yeah anyway i'm not gonna waste your time playing video games here but um just yeah know that this this setup is um really good for that so the issues i have though is that it um there's several issues. I'll get into them in a minute, but um, I just want to point out that there are cheaper solutions, which I'll also go over here in a second. But this, if all you need is uh, your screen to be mirrored to your an external monitor, this will work just fine. Um, this is probably the highest quality version of this uh, of your options. Um, there is some uh, much cheaper versions, but the the image quality from what I understand are not going to be the same. I think there's a little bit of lagginess and and on the external monitor you'll get like pixelated um, images, especially with fast movement and stuff like that um, with the cheaper setups. And I'll show you those cheaper setups here in a minute. But uh, let me uh, exit out of this game and then I'll show you how all this is connected. I guess I'll cover one one more little aspect on what what you can use this for and what you can't use this for. One thing you can't use it for is uh, watching like Netflix or any kind of like streaming, paid streaming content like um, Amazon Prime or whatever it is, uh, because it it's encrypted. So as you can see, like you can see the image, the the you know the video playing on this screen, but it's black here. So, I mean, some of you already know this, but I don't know what that is, but anyway, I'll show you. So the reason why you can't do that is because it has high bandwidth digital content protection, which is an encryption uh, standard or whatever. Basically, if uh, it's something that you're supposed to be paying for, they encrypt it with this and it prevents you from being able to stream the content or the video to some other device to help protect it from being pirated so so you're not going to be able to find like a device like this it's going to be able to output um uh this kind of content um for your pixel 6s at least um so anyway i just wanted to cover that uh the other issue that i have is the the mouse mouse cursor here as you can see it's on the pixel phone itself but you see nothing on the screen here. Um, so that makes it really difficult to operate the screen without having to look at the, uh, the, the mouse screen. You can't just use, just, you can't like just tip that down and, and use the, you know, use the mouse to operate it. It's not going to work. You can't see where the mouse is at. Um, so if you're trying to, if you're hoping to use some setup like this as like a desktop alternative, it's not going to work on the Pixel phone, um, unfortunately. So get like a Samsung or LG phone that supports the HDMI out. Samsung Galaxy phones, they have the um, their system and I've used it on my phone, my Galaxy uh, 21S or whatever, Ultra, and it works really well. So that's not going to work with your Pixel phone. Just be aware of that. Um, so I'll go over how this is all connected. Um, you have your power adapter here, uh, goes into the wall, um, provides power to everything on the back. So you have, uh, you know, USB cables. So I have my mouse, keyboard, 
this one goes to the external monitor provides uh, power so and then this one here it goes from so let me get a better view here so this one goes to your uh, pixel phone so USB-C out to the pixel phone here you connect it there and then uh, this is the video out uh, so you have two display port um, connections so um, just so a lot there's a lot of confusion um, between what is a uh, display port and display link display link is a graphics chipset and there that's the name of the company that makes the graphics um, chips inside of this box that uh, allows you to stream the, whatever's on the phone here to an external monitor um, and display port is the the port the video port um, connection that's the name of that port so this this hub comes with a display port to HDMI um, adapter here so you don't have to worry about that um, you just get the uh, HDMI cable if you don't already have one and make that connection between here and your HDMI monitor which on this in this case is here and this is a micro or mini HDMI connection I forget and um, that's what that looks like so yeah that's how all that's connected um, but before you actually make the connection to your phone you need to download the drivers and I'll show you how to do that now so just go to the Play Store type in display link presenter and download the display link presenter by display link UK LTD whatever and then uh, you don't even have to open up the uh, the app it's already installed it's, it's basically just a driver um, that allows the hardware to talk to your phone um, so after you do that then you can uh, connect the cable to the phone I'll show you what that looks like now I'll disconnect this right now and then I'll, I'll reconnect it so you can see what that what happens when you do that all right so you just connect the USB-C cable coming off the hub into the back of here like that when that happens you'll see this pop up see there's no nothing on the display there it just asks him for you know to confirm that you do that another pop-up comes up and then you hit start now and then uh, you'll see it like boom makes the connection you're mirrored you now have a mirrored um, pixel 6 to an external monitor so that is how that works now I'm going to show you how to the the cheaper solutions um, I haven't tested these out but there's a couple YouTube videos that talks about this uh, one of them this is one one of them it's really simple all it is is a, a USB on one end of the cable and a HDMI on the other this little box is a chipset the graphics chipset so this will allow you to output um, mirror your pixel 6 uh, video to an external HDMI monitor so this is uh, one of them um, and then the other one is is this one and you can uh, go on Amazon and just check this out and um, and buy these but they're not going to be 4k um, which is fine because the pixel 6 doesn't output 4k anyway so um, but they're way cheaper like 16 bucks or 17 bucks and 19 bucks so so it's a lot uh, much much cheaper than um, than this one that I bought by uh, media gear so anyway so there's multiple solutions so this is the same adapter I used in the, the first video um, you can find find it by um, searching for that part number again it's a display link certified hardware inside the chips so anyway um, I think that's um, all that I need to say in this video this I'm not gonna make any more videos on this because I bought a Galaxy phone. I am frustrated with the Pixel phones because there's these limitations on it and I, I just don't, I'm tired of it. So just not worth it to me. Um, so yeah, if you're looking for like a desktop alternative that you can just plug your phone in and uh, use it as a desktop, um, 
that pixel phones are not what you're looking for so so you might want to just sell your pixel phone and buy like a samsung galaxy phone or lg phone that supports hdmi out and they also have software uh, I forget the name of the Samsung software, but it, it works really well. I've used it. It turns your phone into basically a desktop and it changes the interface so you can use a mouse and keyboard really well with it. So anyway, that's it for now. Um, hope this helped. You guys take care. Bye.